How's it going everyone? This is Kevin. Today I want to bring along with me to go to a coffee shop to do some portraits and just some photography at the coffee shop. So let's jump right into it. So a long time ago I did a video shoot at a coffee shop here in where I live and I actually posted it a while back and oddly enough it got a lot of traction and I thought it was kind of cool and it got me thinking that I probably need to do another photo shoot kind of video at a coffee shop. The funniest thing about it is I really didn't plan that shoot. I kind of just got in contact with the owner of them. I told him that I want to do a video because I had recently gotten my Sony a7 III at the time and I thought it'd be kind of cool to do a video shoot to just, you know, test out the camera and do everything like that. And it turned out pretty cool. So it kind of got me thinking that I just need to go ahead and, you know, go branch out to some coffee shops again since it's been quite a while. So we're going to go to this coffee shop near us that we've been to a couple times and I think it has a cool little aesthetic that we're going to try to capture a little bit of portraits as well as just the aesthetic of the store just to maybe use it as a future portfolio kind of piece or also just you know doing a little bit of the lifestyle kind of you know portrait photos just because I thought it was a cool location and we're going to see how that goes. So the ultimate goal is to try to get some portraits with the coffee, my wife kind of drinking it just the aesthetic of the, the, the shop itself and just kind of get creative with it as much as we can it's uh, going to be interesting since obviously we're theoretically just going to go and show up i usually try to like reach out to businesses in advance to see if i can use them but today we're just going to go ahead and enjoy some coffee and just take photos so let's get to it welcome to common bond coffee shop where life is sweet they're a cool coffee shop and bakery that provides you with a warm and inviting space to gather with friends and family. We wanted to come in and enjoy some great coffee, a delicious cookie, and take some photos since the place just looked too great to not capture it. So we took a couple portraits here in the coffee shop and as well just took a little bit of the photos around the scenery to get these shots that I was pretty content with. We made our way back outside to do a different type of shots now with the to-go cup just to also capture the outside of the coffee shop. My main focus was to kind of get more shots with her drinking the coffee and just being in the atmosphere of the outside part of the coffee shop since it's something that's really cool to have whenever you go to the coffee shops to be able to be outside of it and have a good aesthetic. So I think we got to capture some great photos when we we're out here taking these shots. As we were gearing up to leave, I kind of noticed this cool little framing within the window that I wanted to capture her being in front of it because it had some cool lights behind her. So I wanted to make sure to get some photos of her just drinking the coffee and holding the to-go cup and ensuring that you could see the logo as much as possible to show the branding in that aspect. My main focus was just to show kind of like the lifestyle of drinking their coffee and seeing how good it would be and how good it would look whenever you're there. Well, we're basically done with all those photos walking over here because we've never explored this area as much and i kind of want to just go ahead and give you guys my final thoughts of how the shoot went and what i thought about it what i wish i could have done differently just because i have some thoughts for you guys little birdies over there just chilling well we found somewhere nice to just sit down and give you my final thoughts when it comes down to just kind of do that little portrait shoot slash coffee shop photo shoot that we're able to do today so the main thing that I thought was a lot of cool and just kind of like fun is just the aesthetic of the place looks nice. It just makes it easier just to get kind of like nice photography going because, well, it just has a good aesthetic. Obviously, as most coffee shops try to do is have a nice environment for people to come out and hang out, have their drinks, sit down, talk, maybe do some work or something like that. So it makes it kind of easy to take some photos that way. But now talking about people, that's when it kind of sucks a little bit because you have to rely on hopefully not enough people, you know, taking up the frame that you're trying to capture or just kind of bother in a sense because you don't want to be shooting in a certain direction that people kind of get a little bit annoyed or anything or think that you're invading their privacy. So that's one of the downfalls whenever it came down to this shoot, obviously if we're able to maybe plan it out a little bit better with maybe the owners or talking to the managers or something like that to say, hey, is it okay if we take these photos and kind of maybe give them to them if they want to, just be able to kind of create a lot more comfortably, probably would have gone a little bit better, but 
despite of that, I still think they were pretty cool to just take some photos out there and just kind of do it where it's like maybe showcasing what it could be if they hired me to do some just portraits with their like coffee so that people would be enticed to want to go out, have some coffee, take some photos and enjoy their time out there. See, for me, that's the whole purpose of this photo shoot is kind of doing a little bit of somewhat of a portfolio build up because I haven't really gone to do as much coffee shops like kind of style of photos. And I kind of want to get back into it a little bit more. Ever since I did that video with Blue Door Coffee, I thought it was kind of cool to do. And I want to get back into doing a little bit more of those. Well, to work with businesses in the area to kind of give them some content that they could use for their social media. So that was the inspiration of today when it came down to the photography side, as well as some of the kind of b-roll video that we had within the coffee shop itself but what i loved about it was just really just simplistic photos that just look really cool because of the aesthetic of the coffee shop what i wish we could have changed is having a little bit more of that tranquility to do different types of angles and different types of you know just uh poses and everything like that to capture different aesthetic vibes when it came down to inside the coffee shop but that's why we went outside as well to just create a couple different types of photos just to have some diversity and just enjoy that way to at least have some some different photos that we would be happy with and I think we succeeded with that today. The main thing was that we just went out and created which is all that matters just to be able to get better within every video that I make or photo shoots that I tend to go ahead and do. It's getting sweaty hour out here in Texas and I'm not enjoying this. This is this is very humid out because it's been raining a lot so I'm about to just kind of you know pretty much call it uh, call it a day so yeah that, that's pretty much all that I got for you guys when it comes down to this video. That's just you know the way we roll out here taking some photos and everything so i thought it was a lot of fun but with all that said and done guys thank you so much for watching this video make sure to like and subscribe to this video the friend will catch you guys in the next one see ya